have a very hard job. I mean, it's just, it's that simple. And it's a lot harder when it's warm. Hillsborough County says it is spending millions of dollars on air conditioning repairs and total system replacements for some schools. The county says despite the millions spent, it's struggling to keep up with AC system demands. Part of the problem is this year's hotter than normal weather. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson joins us now live in Tampa. Jeff. Good evening, Jenna Keith. The Hillsborough County School System says this year they either made major repairs or total system replacements for 14 schools air conditioning systems. Seven schools are scheduled to have that kind of work done next year. And despite a sales tax, a half cent sales tax referendum passed by voters in 2018, the school system says they still have millions of dollars of repairs to do. It happens at the start of every school year. As students and teachers return to class, problems with AC systems pop up, making lots of work for HVAC specialists like Brian Chapman. One of the reasons why the main units, why the units go down is you gotta think about it over the course of the summertime. You have classrooms aren't full, rooms are at real low capacity, and the units are just chugging along. Well, as soon as you bring the teachers back and the students back, them things just ramp up. They try to just, room temperature rises, and they just, it just struggles. Last year, Hillsborough County replaced more than 200 AC units in the county, costing more than $87 million. The county says all of this was made possible by a half-cent sales tax increase in 2018. But the county says even with that, there are more projects to complete. We had a billion dollars in deferred maintenance because the funding that came along with both air conditioning and roofs wasn't, did not keep up with where we are, the millage rate. The county says one reason more systems are failing this year is because of our hot weather. With this unprecedented heat, we are dealing with a lot of smaller outages, a lot of major outages. My team is working daily to resolve them as quick as possible. And as I said, the county plans to replace or make major repairs to seven schools air conditioning systems next year. Of course, that number could change if something breaks between now and then. Live in Tampa, Jeff Patterson, eight on your side.